Hey guys, this is Matt for Creative. Today we're here with the later case. And you know all the controversy around the later case. This is made by Lou from Lou Later, and this is something that I think is a cool case. I got it when the discount came around. It's originally $45, but this I got for $35. So I got the one for the iPhone 11 Pro, not the Max, just the iPhone 11 Pro. So I'm gonna open this up and we're going to take a look at, wait, how do I do this? Take a look at everything here. All right, so that was the black outside box. What else comes in here? Oh, this is a cleaning cloth. Okay. I really enjoy cleaning cloths and um, this one's kind of wrapped up. So we're going to take a look at everything inside here, seeing if it is worth the $35, even though I don't really know. I When I like a case, I just like a case and that's pretty much it. Um, cleaning cloth is good. It's a little clean cloth and that's it. You probably have a ton of them around. So this is the case here wrapped in plastic to protect it because white can stain a lot but let's take a look here's that little pull tab it's magnetized and here is the case inside and <clears throat> I remember him talking a lot about you know dedicating a lot of time to figuring out how this case will work you know the way that he wanted it to work and um, I'm feeling this this is okay here's the inside here this is lightweight it it honestly honestly feels like cardboard paper. Now, let's take a look here. I want to make sure that you can see this. There's that pattern. So the pattern's on the inside. On the outside, I can feel the weave, but I also feel grippiness, too. It feels pretty, pretty grippy. On the camera here, where the camera is, there's a, like a, it's a very extremely thin case. Like, I almost feel like I would be snapping this in half, and I'm not going to do a bend test or anything, because that's Ridiculous for for me other people can do it. Um, I want to use the case here But here's like this little housing that goes around the camera so the camera won't damage everything for me <clears throat> For me. I like all kinds of cases. I like life proof cases. I like uh, Silicone cases leather cases, whatever. I currently have on here and my favorite case is this kind of um, What do you call it clear? plastic case that I got on Amazon for four dollars and it's been great it's kind of uh, yellowing from being in my pocket but it has protection and it feels good I put my pop socket on there so that's I'm, I'm happy with all types of cases all right so we have the naked phone here I'm gonna put this case on here and it clips right in and that feels nice it feels like an extremely lightweight phone like it's just the phone with grip so it has this grip on here. It does cover the edge here. But one thing that I see is that if you rest this on a table, it will not, there is no lip on here that will kind of protect the screen from scratching. So it's not one of the cases where you can put it forward, kind of like this case, where you can rest it on its front and it will be touching case instead of touching top screen. This one definitely is going for this little as thin as possible minimal look and maybe that's not your thing but for me this phone uh, without a case has been extremely slippery and I appreciate the grip on there it it honestly feels like there's nothing on the phone and it just it has a good grip to it because I had such a hard time holding this thing without some type of case and that's really why I got this four dollar case and I was like I'm gonna upgrade and I never did and I just stuck with that cheap thing all right, so if you can see here, here is the camera housing. And it has that little lip too, so the cameras will not be scraping against anything. And you can set your phone down like this. Now, instead of having kind of um, properties in the case that would allow a button to press through it, it just has cutouts for the buttons here. And you can see here on the other side, cutouts for the volume rocker here, and of course, cutout all the way down here for the uh, speakers, microphone, all, all you know, all the lightning stuff here. At the very top, it has a cutout here, which I'm not sure why it has a cutout here. There's nothing up here. I guess it's just uh, an aesthetic choice. I'm fine with it. I just like that I can hold this by the side and feel like I'm not going to drop it like I always do with other cases. 
Um, now one thing that's very important to me, I'm going to see later, because this is a uh, kind of special pop socket to me, the Mandalorian, I'm going to find a, uh, a regular pop socket and I'm going to see if it can stick to the back of this, because it is not perfectly smooth, it is just, um, yeah, it is kind of, what do you call it here? I don't know Kevlar outside of Kevlar being um, used to protect you from bullets and all that. I've never had a Kevlar case. And I can see the weave on here. Now I forget, and I don't know if he actually put anything, any property on top of it to make it more grippy, but I appreciate whatever material is being used here to give me grip, because this is a very thin case and I think this will do very well. I'm going to try it for a little bit, so if you have any questions about how things are going, you can reach out to me in the comment section. You can also find me on Instagram at m8b9. It's that simple, and um, I'm gonna start doing a lot more content here. I'm excited, and uh, hey, this is something that I'm excited to use. It's not gonna be sliding ever anywhere on the back. I'm happy with it. All right, guys, if you have any questions, this is the later case and you can get this online, you know. This is from Unbox Therapy and Lou Later and Lou, and I'm not sure what his last name is, but this is his case. I did get it for $35 with the $10 discount that he was doing. I'm not sure if that's still available, so expect to pay $45 for this. But I'm very happy with this. It's, um, it feels really nice in the hand, but hey, there's a lot more testing to do. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.